Hey, what's up, guys? I'm very torn. And Jinx here. And welcome back to Aliens Dark Descent on the nice PlayStation 5. We cannot get through that Shut intro up, God. without them They're jabbering. Look at all these aliens. Just wandering around. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need to try and avoid them because we don't want to rile up the hive if we can avoid it. Oh, well, they're in perfectly spaced intervals. How are you going to do that? <laughs> More signals incoming. I think we're all right. As long as we let this guy go, I think we should be good to go. They have a really good routine going on here. Mm hmm They work together as a team. Good job, guys. I mean, no. <laughs> Boo, aliens. All right, so Why would I want our team to get eaten? So He's going to open this up. And then hopefully... I don't think they... You know what? He can actually get through that, can't he? He can open doors. Well, that's the one that we welded shut. Oh, so he's going to pry it open? Yeah, they can get through the, the weldings. So we need to hurry up and get in here. And then get this opened. Go, go, go. Let's see what's in there. If there's anything in this room to get. Yep, that terminal has been sabotaged. We're trapped. Squad lead, you might want to close this door while we look for a solution. Get me a stable sack comic. Broken terminal or not, I should be able to open that bulkhead door from here. You heard the lady. Find us a SATCOM uplink. That sector map could help us find the SATCOM and a path to the hostages. Okay, so basically we need to go to that room we were just in. Wow. I think it's in this one here. He's coming right for But yeah, we got an alien that's going to come in here. It didn't see us. So we just need to stay hidden over here, though it He's looks right like... Hopefully we'll be okay. <laughs> they can't see good. <laughs> it's seen us. Oh. <laughs> oh damn. Nice tail swipe. Get out of here. Okay, so that's unfortunate. <laughs> we got caught. Good job, guys. Okay, so let's see how I guess we need to go back through here. Move, move. Why do I sound like that? <laughs> yeah, I'm really liking it. Good job, guys. I think it sounds ridiculous. Alright, so I think we just need to open this here. Yep, bypass bulkhead door. Oh, that's easy enough. Yeah, it's just a bummer because, you know, we've, we're getting all this stress. Which could have been avoided. And then also you got the alien going into there. And it would have been best if, uh... Oh, and also we need to heal They're somebody now. Alright, so that's unfortunate, too. Oh, damn. So it looks like Jinx, you're the one that needs I to be healed. the tail. Yep. You don't tell what tell with you. Right in the face. And then, is he coming in here? He doesn't there know where go. he's going. He's, he's so confused. Listen, I think we're good. <laughs> we're fine. Come on, team. Is he coming this way yet? He is. So when he comes in here, is he not gonna come in here? No. He's this is right ridiculous. Now. Every time Let's you get up, though, side. he's gonna come for you. If he just goes down here, then we'll be fine. And just trying to avoid these guys. If we can. All right. Hurry so let's up, hurry up and squad. go. Hurry up, squad. All right, so Move if we can get it. through here and then get back to this area and get this door open. So yeah, we should have did that before we welded ourselves up in that room. That's disgusting. Is what it is. Got him. I mean, why are you grabbing on his butt like that? Is Who that was where that? you get the samples? That was, that was Webb. Web, you're nasty. <laughs> Go yeah. wash your hands. I, I think that's where we get the samples. No Black wonder these glands. aliens hate us. We're like probing them and stuff. I don't really blame them. Oh goodness. Hurry up, you okay, we're gonna have difficulty avoiding that alien. It's seen us. <sighs> All right. So that's unfortunate. 
You're not gonna bite me again. <laughs> oh, we can't even go through here. Alright, so let's try going this way. Cause... Are you gonna get the butt gland? Did, we, did he have them? I don't know. No, he didn't have them. Oh, we can't, we can't, have butt yeah, glands? Yeah, we can't get them off. Only some of them. Well, I could get it off. <laughs> <laughs> How do you get into this door? They're heading our way. Oh, we got oh, another alien coming. Come on, hurry, Get Jinx. Oh, and they got some eggs. Oh no. All right, so we need to explode them. Grenade. So that'll let the alien know where we're at. They're gonna explode on their own. Well, we got it, Jinx. It's blue all over the place. Although I think the alien probably knows where we're at now. And we are really stressed out. Yeah, this is stressing us out. Oh, we just barely hit that thing. Get out of there. Don't get acid on you. Uh, it burns. Okay, so maybe this is how you unlock it? I mean, we're not doing that bad in stress. But considering the, the section we're about to do, I'm a little bit worried about the stress situation. And we got another alien well, coming. That one looks like a runner, though. It's pretty quick. Yeah. He doesn't know a rat. He's not the smartest alien. He just runs real fast. It's your lucky day, Marines. Take as much as you can. All right. So what we want here is the supplies. We don't need the med kits. So we get all this. Do the med kits reduce stress? Yeah, you could do that if you want to use four med kits. I mean, because you'd have to use it for every single person. Okay, but I'm feeling really stressed. You do it with this here. And it'll reduce the stress by 100. And so that's an alternative, but unless you're going to use it for every single person. I, have well, I mean, I don't care about the others, but. <laughs> <laughs> Jinx just worried about her own stress level. I just need something to take the edge off, that's all. See, that's why we didn't make Jinx the I'm medic. I'm a squad leader. <laughs> I got a lot of responsibility on my uh -huh. shoulders. Let's keep the, the drugs away from Jinx. Hurry up, squad. Alright, so I, I want to say there's some more eggs somewhere. It's been a while since I've done this mission. I haven't been playing the hit there. I haven't been playing the game lately, guys. We're not going to get that in time. Maybe. Nope. Close enough. No, I think Don't alien hurt us. Don't mess with me, penis worms. Maybe we can hide from it. Safe position taken. Hide. <laughs> They'll never know. We'll never know we're in here. <sighs> Control your breathing. <laughs> oh, he's gonna see us. There's no way he doesn't see us. Oh, well, maybe. No, he's not very smart. I told you the runners don't seem all that smart. They're just really fast. They're just running like crazy. Alright, looks like we made it. Is he going to come back, though? Because he he's crazy. You can't tell what he's going to do. Yeah, he's just all over the place. He's on crap. He reminds me of... Remember on Over the Hedge, the little squirrel we guy? Oh, you, yeah. So when you gave him, what was it, coffee or energy drink? Or, I mean, I was thinking before he got the energy drink. Oh, before drink. that? We don't really need the ammunition, guys. I mean, we could get it. Right it's just not really a reason to, though. And you never know, we might have to come back to the map and everybody dies. And so might as well I leave it. I don't want to die. Because we're sitting on 15 ammunition currently. And that's quite a bit. But we do have an area. You know, there's a lot of fighting coming up. Yeah, whatever. Why not? Because I don't think we come back to this. I'm, you know what? We might. We're right. never coming back. It doesn't matter, guys. Let's just take all the ammunition. We want it all. So we have plenty of ammunition now at this point, so we really don't need to get any more. I don't know if there's anything worth getting in here. Hey, Sergeant. We found a civilian in one of those cocoons. Get him out mm. of here, quick. Careful, Sergeant. We've been there. Don't worry, Hayes. We'll check him for infection. Don't worry. I'm sure he's fine. <laughs> he's gonna come out a beautiful butterfly. So we just need to remember that he's in here, if you can help remember it. We do have the big thing on the map. I'm not telling you shit. He's infected. I mean, it says before he's infected. You gotta rescue him now. 
I just don't want to carry him <laughs> this whole time. I don't know if he'll walk and shoot and stuff, but we're not walking all the way back to the vehicle. Uh, oh, that's not him. Okay. That's the... Like he's <laughs> <laughs> so he, big old man. He's in bad shape, but he's still alive. Let's just leave him in here. He's not dead yet. We're just going to leave him in here. And then we'll... Maybe come back and get him later. Don't we'll get out of there. Okay. Alright, this so looks like we got out of there just in time. They're heading our way. There's something over there, but I don't think it's worth waiting for that. Probably that running feller is going to eat the guy. I need to hurry up and get over here. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Okay, so let's... Yeah, he might go after him. We'll have to see. Right now. He's like, and I'm back in the cocoon again. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of them here. Means you're in the right place, Marines. Deal with them before the critters join the party. Honestly, I feel like letting the critters join the party would be helpful, right? Yeah, that would be helpful. And why am I walking in here like, there's a lot of them here. <laughs> they can't hear me, though. <laughs> All right, so we need to, like, sprint over there. Come on, team. So that we're in cover, and then we need to start using their grenades to take Just out. Blow everyone to smithereens. Mm -hmm. Do as much damage as we can here to these guys. Noise. We got this guy running up here. Let's not let him. Oh, we could have shot that as he ran by. I suppose we'll do a little overkill there. <laughs> we got another yeah, running guy here. We should better get him killed. All right, so now it's just this guy that's the problem, which I think that person might be dead soon. Light him up. Get him. Oh, we're barely hitting that guy. Yeah, this guy's still alive, too. Changing back. We're just shooting at the wall. Take a Watch I mean, I guess it's a good thing we uh, got all that ammunition. It, it does seem like it consumes a stupid amount of ammunition. Taking out the, uh... Taking out the humans. Because they're behind cover and stuff. Feels like a data pad. So what we want to do now is make sure our people are as in as good a situation as possible. Honestly, it wouldn't be a bad idea to use one of those tools real quick up, to get rid of the stress. Because if I recall correctly, I think there's about to be a lot of fighting. But I'm freaking out, man. So let's weld this and then give Jinx a rest because she's freaking out. I'm freaking out. She can't handle it. Drone reacquired. Yeah. Alright, so let's go ahead and give him a quick little rest. Little Gizmo needed a break too. The reason why we're getting a break is because you needed it, Jinx. You it's couldn't for handle the it. robot. Couldn't handle your shit. It's for the drone. Wakey, for wakey. web. All that. Picking in butt. <laughs> That'll stress you out. <laughs> you looking for a nice spot for a picnic or what? Drone reacquired. All right. I'd be worried if it didn't stress you <laughs> out a little bit. <laughs> you enjoyed it. <laughs> like, oh, this is how I stress relief. <laughs> Just some butt probing. Butt probing aliens. Now we're the jerks. Yeah. <laughs> Going around swooping people up. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and clear everything out. There is a lot of stuff here that we're gonna want to get, and one of those is an additional turret. We're gonna need the turret, guys, and we'll probably want to set this up before we interact with that, because I don't think they give you a lot of time to do it once they kind of let you know that you're gonna be in a defensive situation. So we'll just leave the rest of those ammunition points. But yeah, I believe they come up from these holes here. That seems like a place an alien would pop up. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like a flower. Yeah. Alright, so what we should do is probably set them up here. I wonder what they smell like. The aliens? Yeah. I don't know. I feel like leather. <laughs> I think they smell like leather. Yeah, like pleather. 
All right, so let's go and set the one sentry right here. Sentry almost ready. Again, they come from all directions, so there's not really any like optimum place, I don't think. I think that this is most likely the best. I don't know. They're going to come from no matter what you do. We only have two turrets. I feel confident in your plan. You're just like, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> we'll just throw some turrets up and shoot some stuff. So what we'd probably best do in here is making it so it covers both the side and over there somewhere. Deploy like that. I don't know. Sentry almost ready. It's almost like I'm making the plans. <laughs> <laughs> Got something on the tracker. Just like, I don't know. I'm sure it'd be fine. Well, because again, there's not really any optimum way because they come from all these different directions. Like they come up from here. And then where are you going to be? You actually have to move all over the map. Like, but all over this area. you screwed no matter where you are. Yeah, there's really not an optimum. There's just no point in living. In fact, maybe we <laughs> should... Jeez, Jinx. That's depressing. <laughs> oh, but I think there's an alien coming in here now. Yeah, see, then we get the warning here. Let's just go ahead and right activate it now and hope that... <laughs> well, they didn't give you much warning. They're like, danger. Hurry. All right, so now we're in a defense phase, and they're going to start coming after us here. Well, they came out of nowhere. Yep. So there's those fast ones. Yeah, they're so quick. And then they run up and pounce on you. Like a kitty cat. Can I tame one? Could be, but we need more intel. Go check another terminal, Marines. So now we have to go to another terminal. And so you can see that, you know, unless you bring the turrets with you, can I carry it? And then set them up each time, which I suppose you could. I'm strong. Alright, let's go ahead and have somebody inspect that terminal. And then I guess what we could do is just kind of make our way over to the turrets. Kind of hang out over there. Because they're going to start coming again. So there's the one. That one's already dead. I mean, really, it's not working He's out too done. bad. That one's going to be a problem. The one that just sprinted up out of there. Or the one that's gnawing on my biscuit. Ooh, somebody's very badly wounded here. Whoever this is needs to be first aided. Oh, that's weird. Looks like Sharp needs to be first aided as well. Again. Yeah, I don't like the sprinty one. <laughs> yeah, they're too quick. So they're able to get up to your to the acid so quickly. You know, let's get into a little hidey hole here, and I guess this is where we need to do the thing anyways. And then let's go ahead and heal up. I mean, geez, kind of need to heal everybody up, don't we? We're not doing so good. Yeah, everybody's kind of in a bad spot right now. God, your Don't elbow would be the worst up. place to try to bandage. Like, Shit. nothing's staying on that. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, could you just send to their death? I sent him over to go get the med kit. <laughs> and now he's got acid in his face. Yeah, it didn't work out. I didn't know they were going to come over there. He'll Who's never sharp? work again. <laughs> Isn't Sharp like an old man? He's a model. <laughs> He's an older male model. He's a Marlboro man. <laughs> All right, let's go inspect the terminal. Yeah, screw those guys. They're too quick. Yeah, they're stupidly quick. And so it's very difficult not to get assed it up. Yeah, I feel like this wasn't the worst spot for us to have the turrets set up. No, it's not bad. We haven't been able to I love it make use of like our fire yet. They're calling them critters. They do, Here come the critters. They do actually call oh, them they critters, do? though. Oh, okay. Should be a compatible comms repeater in hangar C. We got what we came for. Let's go check these hangars, squad. There's an elevator here. It should take you right back outside near the docks. You haven't heard him say that like multiple times? We've got critters Maybe in I coming. Have. I just ignore them. Okay, so what we need to do now, let's pick up our, our guns, and then we need to go back and get that guy. 
before we get, leave here. So we're going to be going out right out this elevator, so it's not very far. we got to come over here and get that guy that we left behind. Do we, though? We ain't going to leave him, Jinx. And he might I be mean, useful. That could be a doctor or something. I'm not entirely sure. I didn't look at his clothes or anything. He just looked like a guy in a cocoon. Now, there's two question marks here. Where is it? Shh. Listen. I think we're good. Hmm. Supposed to be two people. There's one. Where's the other one? You see any dead bodies, Jinx? No. Oh, there's one. Where? The one we just looted? On the right, next to the box. This the one? Dirt. No, he doesn't have anything. Oh. Well, that's a dead body. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's right out here, maybe? I didn't see anything out here. It's quiet. But yeah, you can see there's a, a question mark there. What am I missing here? It's like maybe right here. Maybe that guy's supposed to have hmm. something Maybe on it's him. right outside here. I don't know. Not important. All right, let's go and get out of here, guys. Move! Move! Oh, God. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> Stop trying to sound tough. All right, so if we can hurry up and get in there before the alien comes through, we'll get this person grabbed, and then from here out, we're going really slow, guys, since we'll have somebody in our hands. The tougher I try to sound, the more ridiculous. Hang in there, man. All right. So he's just got the pistol now. That's all he'll be able to defend with. And then also, we're stuck walking. We could send somebody to get that med kit. Because we know Come on, if we already used one and we might need more. Let's see what's inside. And that person will be able to run to catch back up. Alright, so we'll get that. And then these guys are going... Which way do they have to go? I think it's got to go all the way around, isn't it? Hurry up, you slugs! Alright, so that'll allow this person to catch up. And then we'll be wrapping up around here. Ooh, that's high. So I think what's important here is this. You see that? The spaceship? Yeah, that's a ship. And if you recall, we have... Our own ship that's not working, right? Oh. So that's a potentially working ship. So I, I believe we gotta come back here for something off that ship later. On, so a little bit of a spoiler. We need a motor. I I don't <laughs> think it's the motor. Need a hyperdrive. Uh, look at this beauty. CM eighty eight G bison. That's what I call a ship. I know my stuff. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> we don't need you to do it twice, Jinx. Yeah, you we did do. it. You did it for us once. No. Thank you. We I appreciate have to it. Do it every time. Because I yeah, know the question you mark love was it right so there. much. I don't know. All right, so this is going to take us right down stairs. I'm not entirely sure how close we'll be to the exit. Copy. Hopefully we can... Oh. <laughs> I'm just going to leave our Marines. Bye, guys. I told you not to grab that guy. <laughs> All right. Let's get back down to the first floor. And hopefully we're close to the exit here so we can just get back on to our vehicle. Hey, that train's leaving. And if there's more containers aboard... Do you want me to pursue, Sarge? Stay on us, Hunslet. I hate to say it, but we have our orders. It's too late for that. Move on. Okay, so where are we at here? Okay, so we're back outside in this area. So what we need to do is probably hide out somewhere to try and not get seen. We don't really have to fight these guys if we can avoid it. We're like so slow though. I don't know if we can avoid fighting him. Yeah, because he sees you. Do we still have the turret? We do, yeah. Maybe if we like squat down. I don't know. No, well, they didn't see a thing. All right, excellent. We made it. Though if I blow this up, which I'm <laughs> going to do <laughs> to get these supplies, then they're going to hear us. We'll try and let them get a little bit further away, but those guys are just more coming anyway, so I don't think it matters. On my way. 
padding C4. So what we should do is is go here. I don't think they're aware of us yet. But they will be. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, we'll shoot them. They're all hiding out. We need to just blow that up there. There we go. That worked out well. Is there another one here? Oh, we don't need to. Alright, so let's go ahead and get the goodies in here. Looks like we got some materials. Is that it? Is this all that's in here? Bummer. Okay. I don't know if it's worth it. Well, I was going to say I don't know if it's worth it blowing it up just for 10 materials, but we have all this ammunition. And once we leave the map, the ammunition's useless. So you can see that fast thing grabbing up the other one? Mm -hmm. That's one of the aliens grabbing up the, uh, the humans. It's what they want, though. Yeah, well, I'd like to be able to show that, though. Oh, I see. So let's go and call in the Ark. Hang on. All right, it's coming. Maybe the arc will kill him. Yeah, maybe. But I'd like to be able to show it because you can see them, they'll, they'll get on their knees and then just let themselves be grabbed. It's interesting. Yeah, I think he did shoot it. Maybe. Alright, so now we have the arc here to kind of help us out. We're going to drop off this guy and we're not going to leave yet. Because we have this other uh, objective here to reach the warehouse. And we're going to try and get all the objectives done here on the map. So it looks like the guy we just got was a recruit, by the way. I actually didn't want another recruit. We haven't lost any team members yet. We don't need more recruits. What we really need is more uh, doctors. Or more engineers. Alright, so let's go ahead and get this unlocked. Marlo was right. Who the hell is Marlo? Doesn't ring a bell. That container, on the other hand. Let me guess. Enough eggs for one big omelet. Shut up, Hanslet. Dead Hills was no isolated incident. This is a pattern. We need to get our hands on that comms repeater, Sergeant. More than ever. People need to know what's happening on this planet. You're right. Proceed to Hangar C, squad. Come on, team! He's the, the leader of the, of this, you know, cultist fashion. We need to go over here. So this is a mechanic I don't think we've ran into yet, where they're in stasis. And so staying too long in the stasis line of sight will wake up the xenomorph. Running will make them detect your squad faster. Be careful. They're sleeping. Are they s oh. Yeah, they're like sleeping. To ask. And so you can kind of avoid waking them up, or once you get the sniper that has the, uh, you know, recon, uh, you know, character that has the, uh, the silencer on their weapon, then you can take them out with a headshot before they wake up. And so that's pretty useful. I could pat them on the head and leave them a snack. I mean, I guess. I could. I just don't think your efforts to then train we'll be them best friends. is going to work, Jinx. We'll be best friends. <laughs> now, one thing about not fighting them when they're in stasis is then it results in, like, a ton of aliens all around you. Yeah, I'd rather just kill everything that's sleeping. Because unless you can get through this whole area without waking them all up, then it puts you in a really rough situation because you're now surrounded by aliens. Yeah, I don't like when More games do that. Incoming. Like, oh, here's these dangerous things. But you don't have to fight them. You can just creep by. Yeah. I'm mm -hmm. Like, I'm not good at creeping. I'm going to kick a can. I know it. All right, well, I don't remember if there's anything over here. They're heading our way. I guess we'll find I'm out. I'm over here yelling. Yeah, it's great. How, How your characters sleep? are supposed to be in a stealthy moment. On, and they're like team. super loud. Come on, guys. One. Oh, so stealthy. Oh, now you want to be quiet. <laughs> Let's see what's inside. So we're going to loot that. And luckily we have our Ark out here protecting the door. But well, aliens, the fast ones, can still get through there and not get shot. Okay, so you can't go that way. 
So I believe there's an alien right there. So you have to like go here. Can't run. Yeah, they want us to do exactly what they say. Take cover. Go here Six. and then take cover. More signals incoming. And then leave. Before you get seen. Yeah. It seems really difficult. I'm not yeah. entirely sure how you're supposed to do it. And so then it results in all the other ones waking up, you know? They probably meant for them to wake up. I don't know. Mine is bigger. It seems unfair. Check your vital squad. Because, yeah, they told you to go that way. Move on. I don't know if there's anything up here. I'm hit. Contact. Well, let's just go ahead and go up here. Check your vital squad. All right, so we're all stressed out. Great ascended, great all right, so there's an alien. Whoa, it's dipping and weaving. I think these are both humans and aliens that have come in here. You like that, huh? Mine is bigger. And you can see they're still getting in here, the spire vehicle outside. Yeah, these are both aliens and humans in here. Okay, so I want to say... The queen is in this warehouse here. Oh, she would be. Mm-hmm. Oh, we got an onslaught coming. So we need to hurry up and get outside. Like, stat. We can't go fast enough. And then we got a runner here. So we're going to shoot. Hopefully that's good timing. There we go. And we need to hurry up and go. Hurry, 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 hurry. <laughs> and we're going to use the outside. For real. Yeah, for real double time. So we got six minutes before the onslaught gets here. We might have a little bit of time to set up a turret. We know which way they're coming from already. All right, excellent. So let's go ahead and set up a turret here to cover that region for us. And we'll also have the vehicle, of course, helping us out. That's always nice. Mm -hmm. We got plenty of ammunition as well. So we'll take care of the onslaught. So that's already over. Not too difficult. Uh, we are looking at seeing a large enemy come soon, though. They've launched a hunt for your head. Or also, my head. our character's like super stressed out at the moment. are so quick. That's yeah. ridiculous. I think that was, that right was mine. Alright, so we'll go ahead and get that. What I'm thinking is maybe using this area here. Yeah, maybe that's the best way to do it. Move on. Is to use that area. And maybe keep this turret out here. Mm -hmm. Or, if we are going to keep it out here, we should probably replace it better. Have somebody go grab this. And just leave a turret out here, because I imagine we're going to have to come back out here eventually. And so what we need to do is let's set up a turret. And then unfortunately we're going to have to end today's episode before we actually get to go fight that queen. But that'll let us save. We're going to go up there, get our characters all rest in that area. Looks like we just avoided the big guy. So we need to avoid any aliens if we don't want to set them off. Move, move. I don't know if that's going to be possible. We will see. Shit, to us. But yeah, if we can hurry up and get in here. Without setting any aliens off. Get in here, hide out, weld it up. Come on. You gotta work for Pastor Jinx. <laughs> Faster. They're about to come around that corner. I'm scared. All right. Move on. Looks like we just barely got in there. All right, and then we weld that Close shut. That I don't know if they can beat that open or not. Looks like they're... Okay, yeah, they're attacking their, their turrets. I don't know if we'll still have any ammunition left in that turret. Uh, you know, we will go ahead and pick up one ammunition here. We'll leave the other two for when we come back to this level. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and rest here and save this. Hope you guys did enjoy today's episode. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video, subscribe to our channel, 
hit that notification bell and leave a comment. Do hope to see you on the next one where I'll be fighting the queen of this level.